Hello friends, I am Anindya Dattya and today we will discuss about Angular. So what is Angular? Angular is a framework for building single page applications using HTML and TypeScript. It is a open source and was created and maintained by Angular team from Google. Most of the popular web applications today follow the single page application technique to provide a seamless user experience. If you don't know what is single page application, let me explain. As you can see here, I have opened the Angular official website. Now if I click on get started, see the whole page not reloaded, only this section changed here. Again if I change to another page, so only the changes needed to be loaded inside the content area is loading, not the whole page. So that means the whole application will fit in a single page only the routing will change in url and the content will change according to the routing but the whole page will not reload so that is called single page application so what is the advantage of angular so one of the major advantage is it is single page application it will improve the user experience throughout the website and another advantage for the angular is it's a component based framework so you can create each of the section of a web page as a component and we can inject one component to another to create the final layout so that is the most advantage and you can use the same component in different pages so that is the another main advantage of angular for example in this website the header can be separated with a header component and the sidebar on the left side can be created as a separate component it's called left sidebar component and on the right side we have the right sidebar component and in the middle the content area which will change according to different pages be the content area component where we will inject different component for different page so as i told it is a component based framework so what is actually the component a component is nothing but containing three files one is html file which will hold the ui or the layout for the component and the ts which will hold the data to bind inside the html and also the application logic for that component and a css file that will hold the styling of the component so let's get into the folder structure of angular here we have a angular project which is already created so i will go inside it and here we can see we have some files and some folders here the package.json is the main file which holds the list of all used modules for this project and the node modules folder holds all the modules and the src folder hold our application logic so i am running this angular application here in the browser you can see that is the base angular application and now i'll go inside the src folder which is source folder and here we have an app folder which is the base app component for angular application later we will inject multiple components inside this app component and inside app component we can see we have app component.css which will hold the css for the app component and here we have the app component.html which hold the layout of the app component and here we have the app component.ts which will hold the data needed for app component as well as the application logic for app component app.module.ts which is only present on the base app component or in lazy loaded component but for any component there will only three files mandatory that is css file one html file and a ts file if i go outside of the app folder then here we have assets which will hold all the assets like images for this project and the environment.ts here inside the environments folder which will hold the development environment configuration and the environment.prod.ts which will hold the production environment configuration so that is the main file structure of angular and here we have style.css which will hold the global styling for this application thanks for watching the video 
share your experience about this video in the comment section below. Hit the like button if you like the video and obviously subscribe for more upcoming videos.